I'm still not sure. Do we put the stripes on or not? Well, let's go outside and take a look at the car. It might look different in a short time. We're taking a ride down to the to the candy store where they put these stripes on and everything, and I still haven't made up my mind. Let's take a look at the car. And this could be the last time you see it like this. I don't know. What should I do? I'm still confused. What the heck? How am I ever going to know what I'm doing? If this is right or wrong. I don't know. But I wanted to take a last look at the car as she sits now. Just in case we do go with the flow, which might be the red stripe. We'll see what we end up with. But it's going to look nice, I think, with those red uh, seats. The red interior, the red paddle shifters, the red seat belt. I think that red stripe's going to work. But we'll get in the car and off we go to. We're at Wild Things in Leesburg. We've decided to give it a shot, going for the stripe. So let's get going and get the job on its way. We're starting to do the matching to try to match up the stripe with the with the car. And we're trying to get an idea of how how it flows. And I don't I'm not sure. We're looking at the, uh, you know, I think if you did, yeah, if you did this roof first and then went, that might help, because that's pretty, that looks. So you can, like this far over. Yeah, it's just, it looks like it's just a little bit off the crease, maybe a half an inch or an inch off the crease. And this is a, is that vinyl striping we're going to use today? Um, the vinyl? It's going to be a wrap. A wrap. Okay, it's a wrap material. Okay, good. Very good. So Brenda's doing a great job. We'll try to keep out of her way. We're just trying to make sure we line things up. We're kind of looking at this um, this picture here to try to get a similar lines on the uh, cars as are in the picture. Now we're getting the lines put down on the on the hood, and I believe when they put the wrap down these lines they just pull the lines up and it leaves the wrap a nice perfect line that's going to look nice so we got that part done the next part is to do the roof and then the back section and then i think we'll start seeing some wrap going she's just checking she's checking the uh, line up so everything lines up correctly okay we're getting we've got the two lines set here for the hood but if you'll notice the red, uh, the yellow, excuse me, the yellow <laughs> stripes going over the roof, we're going to have a wide stripe on the hood and a narrow stripe on the roof doesn't make any sense. But as I look at this picture here, I look at this picture here, notice there's a narrow, the hood is narrower. I don't think it's the same hood that comes on the Z06 that I have here. Notice there's a dome down the center of the hood. And there's no dome down the center of my hood here. And if you look at this, and then you look at my hood, uh, that center section is much larger. So we're going to have to come up with some kind of an idea to put the stripe down the center of the roof so it doesn't look goofy. Because I think they have a large stripe here and then a much narrower stripe here. I think we're going to have to widen the stripe out a little bit on the roof. Now we're getting ready to put the wrap on the front stripe and that's uh, going on as we speak as you can see and we've actually widened the uh, stripe on the roof so it flows with the stripe on the hood and all should look fine when we get back and all done with this so Got to be, I thought I thought we had it figured out, but with the picture that I had, but the picture is a different hood, and uh, almost didn't trick her, but it almost tricked me, 
And I'm thinking, what the heck, that's not the same hood. The Z06 has a different hood on it. So that is a different hood, and so a different stripe line has to be made. We have front of the aerialist up there. She's hanging very carefully off the car. <laughs> and uh, putting down the stripe for the roof. Again, we're making, or well, she's making uh, accommodations for this car compared to what we saw on the picture that we had. If you look at the picture back there, it, the, root, the hood is different, and therefore the stripe on the hood has to be different. Okay, we got the roof piece on. I keep saying we. I, Brenda's got the roof piece on. <laughs> and uh, smoothing it out, and then they'll pull those little zip strings and get the nice line. And I'll be count up once they get everything down the way they like it. And everything looks good. So again, we see more of the, of the uh, red going on the car. Pretty interesting. There you go. As you can tell, it started to rain out and we're in an aluminum building. And it's raining cats and dogs and small uh, children, I think. It's crazy. But I'll show you, we're just finishing up the, Brent is just finishing up the tail end here. You can see how that's coming along. The final, final, the final cut, the red stripe. Changed the personality on this car. Wow. That looks great. Look at that. I like it. I like it, like it, like it, like it, like it. Like it, like it. We had a discussion about this last piece on here and if we decide we don't like it, we'll pull it off and just leave this piece right here. So we'll see. See, it's all what you want to do here. So it's looking great. Looking great. Brenda's done an off, awesome job. Got the car home. I think it looks great. Thank all the people at wild thing in Leesburg Florida there's their card give them a call if you need anything like this done they're great people thanks